Hey guys, I have on my screen the LG G3 Google TV uh, home launcher, which I never really liked. It's kind of iffy, but you got the uh, quick settings on the bottom and some apps that you can change in there. Of course, you have the smaller screen, premium apps, 3D World, uh, smart share my interests all that good stuff and I never really liked how this looked because it wasn't too conforming to Android so being that this is on Jellybean uh, 4.2.2 I was able to put on Nova Launcher and of course with Nova Launcher you can customize it a lot better than you can with anything else on there so here's my Nova Launcher home screen very similar to how I have it on my tablet, uh, very uniformed. You can see everything is still all there, but on my Nexus player, the material design is a lot better looking than what I could do on Nova Launcher, and I found uh, HA Launcher, or HAL, and uh, let's see what it looks like on here and how it works. This is I've done it once before and it's it's just fantastic so let's go back here go to the Play Store and this is an unmodded Play Store so I mean you can just go right on it from your TV just search for HAL Launcher and it's the second one that comes up and let's install that See, should be done in a minute. All right, so let's jump into it. So, the first thing you'll notice is it's very similar to the uh, launcher on the Nexus uh, player and the Nexus player being on 6.0 you can't have a third party home launcher so it, they found a way to make it a recommendation so you can still use it but you'll see everything works just fine but if you press the home button on your uh, LG G3 Google TV remote you'll see you only have home and Nova launcher so in order to fix that what we got to do is go down to the preferences and we're going to go into the HAL settings. And this very first one right here, it says use app as home app. We want to check that. That's going to allow us to actually re replace the other launchers on here. And of course you can change how many recent apps you want and all that good stuff. But now let's press home. And there it is. And we'll do always. All right, so it has very material design like uh, sidebar here. You know, recent apps, sports handheld, sports TV and handheld, sports TV, which has nothing in there, and preferences. And so, what I would like to do is I'll go into the app list and go into new group. And what I always do is just put TV. Now we have the TV section here, and we're going to get rid of that support TV because it doesn't do anything. Now you can see you'll have all of your apps right over here. Some uh, still the basic stock apps from the uh, LG side of it. Let's go down to Playster. Live TV. Want that version of Netflix online, Google Play Music and TV, Popcorn Time and Prime Time. And you want to check that TV box and then just click Add, and boom, all of that's right there. Now, another one I noticed is there's no 
gaming group. So let's do one for games. Down to OK. So there we have the games. So let's do 3D Game Changer. Drift Max. Fast and Furious Racing. Just Drift. over as well. Go up to games and then just add it's, it's all very simple to do. Where was it? It's down here. Receiver and Plex. We'll put that back into TV. And again, it's very simple, very fluid. Just add. And what we're going to do is we're going to move these to the bottom. So then when we go back, you can see we still got the recent apps up top, support the handheld, support TV and handheld, then your basic TV apps, Oops. and all the games. So this was really made for Android TV or with the Nexus Player or the uh, ADT-1 and of course the uh, NVIDIA one because they don't have on the stock 6.0 launcher any uh, siloed apps so but yeah I mean this is on a pretty old device I, I gotta get my original Google TV from Sony fixed but that's running uh, Honeycomb 3.0 and I, I doubt that this will work on that but it does work on Jelly Bean so 4.2.2 and everything's here it's all working very smoothly very perfect of course you, you don't need root but I always have everything rooted so but yeah as far as that goes it's pretty nice very good material design to it. it makes my LG TV look just like how I have my Nexus player set up so that that's just great well that's it for now see ya